President Muhammadu Buhari on Friday presented the 2023 budget proposal to a joint session of the National Assembly, addressing a joint session of lawmakers from the two chambers of legislative arm. Buhari unveiled a budget of 20.51 trillion naira with a crude oil benchmark price of $70 per barrel, daily oil production estimate of 1.69 million barrel per day, and exchange rate 435.57 naira per US dollar for the 2023 fiscal year. He said the budget was designed to address critical issues and lay a solid foundation for the incoming administration. 23 is to maintain fiscal stability and ensure smooth transition to the incoming administration. This 2023 to 2025 medium-term expenditure framework and fiscal strategy paper sets out the parameters for the 2023 budget as follows. A, oil price benchmark of 70 United States dollars per barrel. Buhari said 744.11 billion naira is for statutory transfers, 8.27 trillion naira for non-debt recurrent expenditure, and 5.35 trillion naira capital expenditure, while the 2023 budget deficit is projected at 10.78 trillion naira. We expect total fiscal operations of the federal government to result in a deficit of 10.8 trillion naira. This represents 4.78% of estimated GDP above the 3% threshold set by the Fiscal Responsibility Act 2007. President of the Senate, Ahmad Lawan, in his opening remarks, commended President Buhari administration for being consistent in the delivery of landmark infrastructure, saying that with the 2023 budget, it is important to prioritize the completion of ongoing projects. Speaking on how to reverse the increasing trend of deficits in the nation's budget, Lawan lamented that generation and collection of revenues have remained Nigeria's major challenges due to massive loss of revenue through oil theft. It's worsened. Recently, the loss of our oil has reached 1 million barrels per day. Translated into monetary terms, our loss is monumental and deleterious. The figures show we are not able to meet the OPEC daily quota of 1.8 million barrels per day for our country. Mr. President, I consider the oil thieves the worst enemies of our country. The thieves have declared war on our country and our people. I strongly feel that we need to take the necessary measures to stop the thieves immediately. Otherwise, our economy will be completely devastated. We are urging a swift and systemic overhaul of the systems in place to protect the country's oil and gas resources. Evidently, the arrangements in place are no longer adequate. As such, there is an obvious need for improvements to stop the loss of income occasioned by this ongoing sabotage. The 2023 budget is crescent fiscal sustainability and transition. CNA News.